So the complete language of flowers, a de definite and illustrated history by S. Teresa Dietz. So the illustrations are really lovely. So you get A to Z situation. So, and you get what like the setup would be for each flower. So, you get like, oh, I mean, so you get like cross reference, reference number when you're looking in the index, primary, um, scientific name. Uh, toxi toxic toxicity symbol if applicable to the flower or part of the flower. Other known scientific names and common names. Symbolic meanings like come to me, I'm shy, my heart is aching for you, etc. <laughs> These are the examples that um, she gives there. Um, specific color meaning. Uh, when applicable for a particular color, spray, seed, branch, etc. Possible powers, love, healing, etc. Folklore and facts. So little tidbits of information. And so, very dictionary, encyclopedia <coughs> type of situation. So, um, Isha, um, Vito, Volgris. So, like, you get like fruits, veggies as well, cacti, leaves. Some are like like this, some are short like that. So you would get multiple page bullet point, very keyword. Um, pine, American Mountain Ash, Hog Plum. So you do get like a variety of different um, flowers, plants in this. So yeah, like very it's a very good book if you like that, like, meaning of flower, meaning of plants type of thing. So, and, again, the illustrations are very lovely. And, like, obviously you can make notes, um, depending on how you make your notes on your books. And they're however you like and whatnot. But, very good dictionary, encyclopedia type of book. Um like the language of flowers, plants, um, appeals to you. So yeah, the complete language of flowers, happy readings.